Hello everyone, and welcome back to another video. I'm your host, Angel Mew, and today I'm going to be opening up this Hidden Fates Elite Trainer Box. This trainer box came out on September 18th of 2019, and it came out after the Hidden Fates tins of Charizard, Raichu, and Gyarados. And um, I will post links in the description of those videos, because I've already opened those up on the channel already, as well as the Mewtwo and Mew pin collection boxes. Um, so today we're going to be opening up this Hidden Fates Elite Trainers box. Um, this is actually a unique trainer box because this one comes with 10 packs instead of your traditional 8. Um, usually the subsets or special sets, um, Elite Trainer Boxes will usually come with um, 10 packs instead of the 8 packs. But you do pay a little bit more. Um, I actually got this from a card store, um, a local card store, um, and actually paid $70 for this thing. And the irony of it all is that I found it cheaper at Walmart eventually. <laughs> but these things were in such high demand. So, I mean, you kind of have to just do what you can do, you know? I mean, so, yeah. But anyways, I mean, it's here. I got it. I'm going to open it. Hopefully, we'll find the shiny Charizard and all will be worth it. So, anyways, guys, um, this is the back of the box. Um, if you're not familiar with Elite Trainer Boxes, um, they come with card sleeves, card dividers, um, a pack of energies, an overview guide of the cards and how to play the game, um, your packs, um, dice, counters, um, the GX Tag Team counter. Um, and like I said too, because this is a special edition, this one comes with a promo card. The um, stained glass um, promo card of the three legendary birds that are pictured here. And of course, the back of the card sleeves and the card dividers and even the box itself all have <laughs> this uh, picture on there. So, did you guys read that? And uh, anyways, let's open this up and we'll see uh, just, you know, more in detail what's inside of this thing. Alright, so there's a box. Nice little slip cover. The guide actually does not fit inside this. Um, on the inside of this, I usually don't like opening these, but... On the inside of this, you can see Mewtwo. And these are shiny, by the way, too, guys. Um, you have the shiny Mewtwo, the shiny Charizard, then you have the basic Moltres, basic, I guess the regular Moltres, and Zapdos, and Articuno. And then you also have just the standard Mew. Shiny Mew is blue, like Ditto. Um, but yeah, that's just a neat little cover. Like I said, you can take this off here. Um, there's it right here, and you can kind of just peel that back, and you can have a nice little poster. I personally don't like doing that, um, being a collector and all, but, and I got enough posters too. So here's a little, uh, player's guide, that's what they're calling it. Like I said, there's your table of contents, and then you can kind of look to see what cards are in this set. I actually do have this Charizard, I believe, and, uh, the Raichu, Mewtwo, the birds... Then the shinies. These are the sought after cards. There's the guy we need right there. Hopefully, it's in this Elite Trainers box. Um, I don't have too many Elite Trainer, or uh, I'm sorry, Hidden Fates products left. Um, in fact, I think the only thing I have left are the collection uh, Pokeballs, the Ultra Brawl, and the Great Ball, as well as the um, kind of like the re release of the tins, but they were like in boxes and exclusive to Walmart. But same thing. Except the only difference is, is you get the jumbo size promos with them. So um, you get it all in a cardboard box, but you get like a jumbo size promo in there. So that's pretty neat. Um, but anyway, these are all the cards in the set, including, you know, hyper rares, secret rares, you know, secret, secret, secret rares, all the shinies. I mean, look how awesome that is. I mean, this is probably one of the cooler subsets out of. All of them, really. I mean, it's just, you know, the artwork and, and everything that went into this set, you know. I mean, it's just amazing. And then you have the gold foil cards. Like, look at those. Are the Tapus? I mean, it it really doesn't get any better than that, guys. I'm telling you. And that's if you want to catch the uh, Pokemon TV on the app. I do have the app. It's actually kind of neat um, and everything. So, anyways, here's our box. Our neat little storage box. This is a cool little thing. I actually like these late trainer boxes. They're really cool. Um, I don't know if I've opened any others on the channel. I think this is the first one, actually. Um, no, actually, I did open one. I opened the uh, Breakpoint one. 
and I'll post the link in the description for that one. Uh, but anyways, here's our Shattered Glass promo card. Just very neat. That's a very cool card there. And that are 10 packs of Shiny Charizards. We've got 10 of them in there. Uh, <laughs> card dividers, there's the code card for this. Good luck with that. Um, your card dividers, pretty much the same on both sides. Um, our stack of energies, because you can never have enough energies. Get one in every pack. Our counters, and these are good counters too. They're like acrylic, really hard plastic counters. Your dice, which are really fancy. And your lead dice, and that is always like an alternate color of sorts. And then of course, our card sleeves. I and mean, I think you get 60 or 65 in here. Um, and these are really cool. 65 it says right there. Look at that. Look at that. It says. Um, so anyways, yeah, these are really neat sleeves. Um, I do use the sleeves. Um, not usually these in particular. Um, for my collection, I actually use plain yellow sleeves, actually. Um, and I can do a whole video on that later on why I do what I do with my collection. Um, but anyways, but I do use them. Um, don't get me wrong. So, um, and then this closes back up in the neat little box and you can kind of see the detail on that which is super cool it feels a little textured so that's kind of neat um i don't know if you can still get these um you know you might get lucky and find them maybe at target um or of course you know you can still get these on amazon i think i saw like this one was still going for like 79 dollars on amazon um you know don't quote me on that but anyways um they're still out there you just kind of have to keep your eyes peeled on it and you know have good luck um, and hopefully get them so um, like I said I paid extra for mine so it is what it is <laughs> so anyways guys let's go ahead and open up our packs let's see we got the Mews we got two Mews two Mew twos nope nope we got three three two and two okay so um yeah let's go with Mew first this is ancient Mew channel and uh see what we got all right, there's the code. And we got Fairy-type Energy, Misty Cerulean City Gym, Sabrina Suggestion, Pokemon Center Lady, Pikachu, Clefairy, Cubone, Jigglypuff, Caterpie, Reverse Hollow is a Staryu, and a Bill's Analysis. Analyzing this Elite Trainer box. Our next Mew Pack, there is Z-Code. Water type energy starts this pack. Metapod, Misty Cerulean City Gym, Magmar, Jigglypuff, Caterpie, Eevee, Ekans, Charmander. Ooh, a fisherman! Full art! Haha, <laughs> very nice! I do not have this one for my collection. And a Star U GX, or Star Me, sorry, GX. <laughs> Very nice. Double whammy pack in this. Awesome. So, not too bad to a good start. You know, first pack was a little bit of a dud, but second pack definitely had made up for that. Our last Mew pack. There's the code card for that. Fighting type energy starts this pack. Misty Cerulean City Gym. Charmeleon. Rock Scrit. Slowpoke. Pikachu, Charmander, Voltorb, Coughing, Reverse Hollow is a Voltorb, and we have a Brock's Training Holographic. So that's very cool. It's interesting to me how like some of these trainer cards, and even like in the newer sets with Sword and Shield and stuff, that they're doing um, revert like hollow trainer cards. You know, very interesting. There's the code. Lightning Energy, Misty's Determination, Metapod, Charmeleon, Psyduck, Clefairy, Magikarp, Ekans, Voltorb. Ooh, we have a shiny Dartrix. Very nice, with his blinking eye. And a Zapdos Holographic, okay. Very cool, another kind of double whammy pack. So, not really a full art, and a GX card, but still very cool, none the same. Next Mewtwo. All right, there's the code for that one. Metal type energy, Graveler, Farfetch'd, Jinx, Eevee, Caterpie, Paris, Ekans, Psyduck, 
Oh, a shiny Gibble. Very nice. And a Blaine's Last Resort. Non-hollow rare. But very cool, another shiny. All right, we got two of them so far. Still have quite a few packs to go yet. I think we have, what, one, two, three, four, five. So we're halfway, so not too bad. There's the code for that. Darkness Energy, Misty Cerulean City Gym, Charmeleon, Brock Grit, Jigglypuff, Ekans, Coughing, Cubone, Geodude, Reverse Hollow is a Charmander, and a Mew non-holo rare. Very cool. I've gotten this card already, so now I have an extra one. So that's very cool. Mew is my favorite Pokemon, if you haven't noticed. All right, there is a code for that. Fighting type energy starts this pack. Magmar, Scyther, Roxgrit, Geodude, Pikachu, Clefairy, Cubone, Jigglypuff, Reverse Hollow is a Darkness Energy, and we have an Erica's Hospitality non holo Rare. So, I mean, these these are cool. I mean, I don't know what the value is of these. Like, I mean, but they're still cool. Um, some sets have done that with Reverse Hollow Energies. Um, some of them actually have the set symbols, but these do not. They're just regular energies with um, hollow foil pattern. There's a the code for that. Water type energy, Lieutenant Surge's strategy, Pokemon Center Lady, Nurse Joy, Sabrina's suggestion, Ekans, Caterpie, Paris, Charmander, Slowpoke, Reverse Hollow is a Pikachu, and hey, hey, there we go, a Moltres and Zapdos and Articuno GX Tag Team card. I believe I now have all iterations of this card, the Rainbow Reverse, or Rainbow Full Art, this full art, and then of course their standard um, tag team card. So these are very cool cards. Um, of course, now we have the um, stained glass um, legendary bird. So we'll stick that one over there. Literally the same card, just different artwork. Next to last pack, guys. There's the code. We have Grass Energy, Koga's Trap, Lieutenant Surge Strategy, Chensi. Clefairy, Magikarp, Ekans, Voltorb, Geodude, oh, oh, a Savali GX full art. Very nice. That is cool. And then a Kangaskhan non hollow So no, no double whammy in this pack, though, but that's still a really cool card there, guys. Check that out. Very nice. Like I said, these cards are so cool. That's probably our only full art GX, but who knows? We can still get a Charizard, guys. Keep your fingers crossed. There's the code. Darkness Energy ends this pack. Scyther, Metapod, Magmar, Paris, Ekans, Psyduck, Staryu, Clefairy, Reverse is a Bill's Analysis, and whoa, Wigglytuff GX. All right, well. <laughs> No Charizard, but still very cool card. I actually, I don't believe I have this Wigglytuff GX, so this is very cool to get this. Um, and end to end the video with a GX, so that's really cool. Um, so this Elite Trainer Box actually was really good to us, um, I think. You know, we got the Full Art uh, Savali GX. You know, we got the Wigglytuff and the Starmie GX. And the, the Bird GX. So we got three GXs, one Full Art GX. We have the full art trainer and fisherman there. You know, then we got the two hollows of Zapdos and Brock's training. And then, of course, we have two shiny there. So, you know, I mean, no, unfortunately, no shiny Charizard. But still a lot of good pulls out of this Elite Trainer box. So um, I got this early when it first came out. So um, I've been hearing a lot of the pull rates have been kind of weak, you know, in the newer, newer Hidden Fates type products. But... You know, all in all, I can't really complain too much, guys. So, um, anyways, guys, I appreciate you all for watching. Please uh, like and subscribe, and uh, stay tuned for more, guys. Thanks.